Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Sorry I've been gone for so long, but I am back today with another video. Today I'm going to be showing you how I achieved this pinup makeup look with a red lip and a simple bun and bandana hairstyle. So enough talking, let's jump right into this tutorial. First, I'm going to start off with the hair. I'm going to be using Frizz Ease today. I'm going to be using the leave-in conditioner their styling foam as well as their mousse. I used to use this all the time when I was in high school. This stuff is amazing. And I'm just going to place all three of those products all over my hair. It doesn't have to be neat or anything. I just like this stuff because it gives my hair a nice wave, hold, and volume, which is perfect for this bun. And then I'm just going to smooth everything up into a bun. If you want a detailed bun tutorial, I have one on my channel. I will link it right above if you guys are interested in that. It's pretty simple, but I will link the video for your reference. And then I'm just going to get out my bandana. And I'm just going to fold it in half and then I'm just going to wrap it around. And I tie my bandana twice. Um, I think it's too long when I just tie it once. So then I tie it again and it's just the perfect length and I just love how this looks. Next, I'm going to prime my face and get ready for the makeup. Once that dries, I'm going to go in with the L'Oreal Infallible Pro Matte Foundation. This stuff is amazing for the summer. It stays on all day. It's pretty inexpensive for a drugstore and it stays matte. Now moving on to my dark circles, I'm using my NYX Correcting Concealer in medium per use. And now I'm going to use my MAC Pro Longwear Concealer. I use two pumps of NC42 and one pump of NC45 and I spread that all over my eyelids, underneath my eyes, and in my T-zone to highlight and conceal. And I'm just going to be dabbing this out with my Beauty Blender. And I use the flat portion to kind of blend out the edges. Once everything is nice and blended out, I'm going to set it in place with my Laura Mercier Translucent Setting Powder. This stuff is amazing for keeping you matte all day. I absolutely love this stuff. And now I'm going in with, I believe this is the Dark and Lovely palette. I'm not really sure. I will link this down in the description box, but this bronzer is amazing. At first I wasn't too sure, but I really, really liked how this turned out. And it's drugstore, so it's super inexpensive. I've been looking for a good drugstore bronzer for the longest time, and I really, really like this stuff. And I'm just going to be bronzing the outer portion of my face and now on to eyes. I'm going to be taking this Anastasia Beverly Hills palette and I'm going to be placing this creamy white shade all over my lids. Then I'm going to be going in with orange soda. Once that is finished, I'm going to be taking this MAC shade and I'm going to be placing that in my crease as well just to deepen it up. And I'm going to be going in with charcoal brown from MAC as well just to further deepen the crease. All of the eyeshadow shades will be linked down in the description box per usual for you guys. And then I'm going to blend everything out with a big fluffy brush. Now on to eyeliner. I'm going to be taking the Wet n Wild Liquid Liner, my all-time favorite, and I'm just going to be doing a very strong, thick wing for this look. Perfect for this pinup look that we are going for. Once that is finished, I'm going to be going in with a couple coats of the L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. This is my ride or die mascara. I love this stuff. You guys know that. I use it in every video. Now I'm going into the Coastal Scents blush palette. I'm taking this reddish purpley color and I'm just going to be buffing that on to my cheeks. And now I'm going to line my lips, getting ready for the red lip. I'm using Vino Lip Liner from MAC. And then I'm going to be going on top with this beautiful red shade from NARS.
And here is the final look. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe if you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel for new videos every week. Again, so sorry I've been gone, but I am back, guys. New videos coming your way very, very soon. I will see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.